Paul Sikala joins us with the story of a Special Olympics family here in Tucson that's struggling with COVID-19 restrictions. Special Olympics Arizona has a big fundraiser every year to get much needed funds for athletes from Pima, Cochise and Santa Cruz County. It all goes down on October 28th this year and it's called Breakfast with Champions. In the past has been done in person. This year because of the pandemic, it'll actually be done virtually. And one East Side family is counting down the moments for the fundraiser itself and also to get back into competition. These are just a few snapshots of athletes from Special Olympics Arizona taking part in competition. But with the coronavirus pandemic, Special Olympic athletes haven't been able to take part in competition as in years past. Special Olympics makes me have fun and get exercise. But Saguaro High School student Katie Langan hasn't been able to suit up because of the pandemic. It's been tough for the entire Langan family who rallies around Katie. In fact, Katie's brother, Jack, who's competed alongside her as a unified player and her coach, has also shared in the Special Olympics energy. When my heart just exploded with pride, I'm watching both my kids stand together and they're there to earn their first gold medal. Not to mention all these medals that Cody, Katie's got. Yes, Katie shows off those medals with pride okay. as she continues to pray and hope she can get back to sports again. I really like to, to be included in these sports and be on the and be included on the team. If you'd like to help out all the athletes of Special Olympics Arizona, we have a link to the Breakfast with Champions fundraiser on KVOA.com. We've got you covered from the west side. Paul Sikala, News 4, Tucson. Crown King residents have been told to prepare to evacuate.